Almost 900 kilometres of the Queensland coast is on cyclone watch today, including Townsville, Mackay and the Whitsundays. A slow-moving tropical low is expected to develop into cyclone Kiralee in the Coral Sea later today or early tomorrow morning before intensifying into a Category 3 system. The Bureau of Meteorology is predicting gales, destructive wind gusts, heavy rainfall and coastal storm tides before the system moves inland. Areas south of Cairns to St Lawrence are expected to feel the effects from tomorrow night. After the cyclone crosses the coast, it's then expected to weaken into a tropical low. However, as it moves further inland and then south across central and southern Queensland, it will still have with it a significant amount of rainfall. And this could bring heavy rainfall to areas across central and south inland Queensland later this week into, weekend, into the weekend and into next week as well. So this could be a very widespread as well as a very long duration event. Emergency services are preparing for two events, the initial cyclone and the intense rainfall that will follow. Some communities may end up isolated by heavy rainfall and flash flooding, especially in areas that are already saturated. The key message from authorities is that now is the time to prepare. It is at times up to 72 hours before emergency services can respond to provide assistance to you after these major events like cyclones come across until it is safe for us to get out and support you. So please take those preparatory activities now, ensure that you have sufficient supplies, your medications, uh, food, water, communications uh, available to support you for 72 hours. Communities in the far north are still recovering from recent devastating storms, but the Premier says they're likely to be spared from the worst of it this time around. Queenslanders are being urged to stay up to date with the latest information as the situation unfolds. It's not yet possible to say with certainty uh, what the impact on places like Logan and the Gold Coast will be. That's likely to come uh, into uh, late in the weekend and early uh, early next week. Uh, so we just encourage everyone to uh, keep an eye on these warnings, uh, listen to their local radio, uh, check the bomb site and their local government area and the Get Ready website uh, to be conscious of what the likely impact on their homes will be.